It's a new sports year at Rock Valley College, and already another team on campus is doing big things. The women's volleyball team has ascended to the number one ranking in the nation in NJCAA Division III after taking down the previous number one team and the number three team in the span of four days. David Greenberg has our story. Under head coach Christy Pierce, the Rock Valley Golden Eagles girls volleyball team has been meshing both on and off the court. This is the most family oriented team I've been on. It's just like we all bond together so well, and there's so much love and passion for the game and everybody, and it's so obvious. Having that play for the person next to you type of attitude has worked wonders. After a recent tournament win over Owens Community College, the previous number one team in the NJCAA, RVC, has overtaken them in the polls. We would rather look from the top down instead of from the bottom up. And I think it just gives us more incentive to work harder to maybe live up to that and maybe, you know, make sure that doesn't go away. This team has come a long way and matured quickly. That's why they're seeing this early success. We came into the season and we were a little scrappy and rough, and there's a lot of freshmen, but they picked up faster than I've ever seen, and they are. Some of the star players, and you see our court is mainly freshman oriented, so we couldn't do it without them. Metz has no intention of doing it on her own. She wants to help lead this squad to a national championship. My goal is to win a natty. I want to win. I just want to bring my team with me on the journey because I'm having so much fun here, and I just want to make sure that everybody feels as comfortable and as happy as I am here. RVC's last championship in volleyball came in 2012, and Pierce knows it's a long road ahead if they want a 2021 banner draping from the rafters alongside of it. Well, we really got to focus on each day and not just that big picture way at the end. We got to focus on getting better each day. So it's more about what happens between now and then versus then. You know, I think that's where our focus has to be. On three. One, two, three. That was David Greenberg reporting. We'll be right back.